Hey guys, it's Rosalie, and for today's video, I am going to be doing a ponytail hair tutorial. So many of you guys know I have pretty short hair right now. I cut it during quarantine because I was bored, and I have been using hair extensions and trying different ones, and for this video, Glam Touch reached out to me and they sent me some amazing hair products. So the first item is the one I'm going to be using in today's video, which is this long pony. Super, super nice. And then they also sent me a messy bun. I am probably going to show you guys how I would wear it, but I'm going to focus on the ponytail in today's video. So the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get some gel and I am going to comb back my hair. So I'm just combing through the gel into my hair. So next I'm gonna just take my brush and I'm gonna brush through my hair and make sure there's no bumps. I'm gonna try to get my hair as slick as possible. So I'm just putting it into a very high ponytail. And then I'm just going to secure my hair nice and tight with a hair elastic. Okay, so I just put my hair in a nice high ponytail. I tried to slick it down as much as I could, but there's a little bit of bumps. We're just gonna ignore that. And as you can tell, my hair is pretty short and it's also uneven just because of the way it's cut. So before I do the ponytail, I'm gonna just show you guys how I would do the messy bun. So first, I'm just going to put my hair in a messy bun, I guess. And it doesn't have to be perfect. It can just be as sloppy as you want it. And then taking this messy bun, I believe it's in dark brown, I'm just going to place it over my bun and kind of just mess with it so it looks a little more natural. So this is basically how I would do that messy bun. I think it is really nice for like a formal event, like a prom or a wedding. I think it would look really pretty for that. And that is just what it looks like on top. And I think it's just really nice to add fullness to your hair. Okay, so going back to the ponytail, I am actually going to fix my little baby hairs and kind of just comb those down really quickly. So I just take a little spoolie brush and some gel and I'm just gonna lay down the edges. For a high ponytail, I like to have really slick hair, but I like to always comb down my baby hairs. I think it just looks a lot more elegant and pretty. After my hair is exactly how I want it to look, nice and slick back, I am now going to put the ponytail hair extension on. I will go ahead and post a picture of what it looked like online and the name of it, but it's basically like a big chunk of hair and it has a little clip right here and then it's Velcro, so you just wrap it around your ponytail, attach the Velcro, and then this extra hair you hide the Velcro with. So what you're gonna do is you're going to just place this right at the ponytail part here, and then you're gonna kind of attach the Velcro around. So you wrap it around the hair, making sure you get all your natural hair inside the hair extension. Okay, so after you attach the Velcro, you should have a piece of hair on the side that you need to wrap around the ponytail. So once you get to the end of that little piece of hair, you're just going to secure it with some bobby pins. So once the hair is secure, I'm just gonna kind of brush through it, just make sure there's no tangles, flatten out the top. So there is the ponytail. Look how nice it is. It is so pretty. I got the color dark brown. Okay guys, so that is basically how I get this really beautiful high ponytail with long hair. If you guys have any questions for me, please ask them down below. I know this was a quick video, but I just wanted to show you guys how you can get this really cute Ariana Grande, I guess, inspired hairstyle. 
I will link down below this piece and also the messy bun down below if you guys are interested. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!